Mind your decisions, I'm Presh Tullwalker. Start with a rectangle and construct one of its diagonals. From the midpoint of the bottom side, construct two line segments that trisect the top side. Then consider the following triangle. If the rectangle has an area equal to 10, what is the area of this triangle? For convenience, you can use these letters to label the diagram. I was suggested this problem by email, and I was told that this problem was given to 10-year-old students. It's quite a challenging problem. Pause the video if you'd like to give this problem a try, and when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. I will present one way to solve this problem. Suppose the rectangle has a height equal to h and a side length equal to s. Then the bottom side is divided into two lengths of s over 2, and the top side is divided into three lengths of s over 3. Next, consider the following two triangles. They will be similar to each other, and therefore their lengths will be in the same proportion. The smaller triangle has a side length that's two-thirds that of the larger triangle. Therefore, if we construct the height of the larger triangle and say it's equal to x, the height of the smaller triangle will be equal to two-thirds of x. We then have x plus two-thirds x is equal to h, which means that x is equal to three-fifths h. Let's put this in this diagram right here, and now let's consider two more similar triangles. By the same logic, their heights will be in the same proportion as their sides. Therefore, if we say the height of the bottom triangle is equal to y, the height of the top triangle will be equal to 4 thirds y. We then have y plus 4 thirds y is equal to h, which means that y is equal to 3 sevenths h. We substitute this in, and now we can solve the problem. First, we will calculate the area of this triangle. Notice that we know its height and we know its base, so its area will be one half the height times its base. We then will calculate the area of this triangle, and again we know its height and we know its base, so we calculate its area and we want to subtract this area. The result will be the area of this triangle. We do some algebra, and we get that the answer is equal to h times s times 3 over 70. Now, we know one more fact. The area of the rectangle is equal to 10, and the area of the rectangle is equal to h times s. Therefore, we substitute in, and we solve that the area of this triangle is equal to 3 over 7, and that's our answer. What's remarkable about the answer is it doesn't depend on the particular dimensions of the rectangle. As long as the rectangle has an area equal to 10, the triangle has an area equal to 3 over 7. Incredible! Thanks for making Mind Your Decisions one of the best channels on YouTube. See you next episode as we solve the world's problems one video at a time.